If you want to find love, here's how you do it. So this is me and my high school girlfriend. I couldn't understand why she liked me. She loved me because I barely liked myself. And I was so afraid one day she'd discover I wasn't enough. I was a senior and she was a junior. So I went to UW-Madison because I didn't want to be too far from her and home because again, it was a miracle that I had this girlfriend. This is what UW-Madison looked like in the winter. I was really struggling to find friends, to find my people, to find my places. The only thing I had going that gave me joy in my life was Alexis. But the problem is she was having this amazing senior year and the weight of my first year was just a lot for her. Her father compared our relationship to a dying puppy and urged her to shoot the puppy. So she called me and said, Harlan, I can't see you anymore. I can't have you see me anymore and ended their relationship. I was devastated and I was all alone. And the problem is I never loved myself. I didn't even like myself. And when Alexis broke up with me, I was left with me. And what I realized is the only way to truly have love in my life is if I loved me. So I've worked over the years to love myself because the only way to be in a healthy relationship, a loving relationship, a safe relationship is to know no matter what, I will always have love in my life because when you love yourself, you always have love in your life. But here's the best part of the story. Once I loved myself, I found my wife, the most important love of my life.